coming up on tomorrow's teaching. Dude, you never pull like any girls, ever. Come here. Get up. Get up. Why do you care? He's an animal. Disgusting for what he did. He took advantage of you and everything. Look, I know you did it. You're not fooling anyone. Now explain to me exactly what happened. I didn't do anything wrong. We can make this real easy. Or we can make this really, really hard. And I don't think you want this to go the hard way. If you tell me what happened, I'll work with you. You're guilty. You're going to jail. But if you make this easier and tell me the full story, I'll help you get a lighter sentence. Come on, work with me. All right, all right. I'll tell you exactly what happened, but I didn't do anything wrong though. Just give me the full, truthful story. I was at a party with some friends. Steven, you're not drinking anything? Yeah, I, I don't drink. <laughs> you don't drink? Bro, we're at a party. Come on, take a swig, my guy. I'm good. I, I'm good. You're killing my vibe, honestly. We'll talk to a girl or something. Look, she's all by herself. Go raise her up. She's bad, bro. Don't be shy. Dude, you never pull like any girls. Ever. At all. Never. Yeah, I do. Watch. <laughs> Ew. What do you want? <laughs> As if I would talk to someone like you. Dude, what a loser. <laughs> so embarrassing, bro. <laughs> this is a common occurrence for me. It's why I don't go out all that much. Uh, I have severe social anxiety. So I was just trying to find somewhere to be alone. Well, why didn't you leave the party then? Because <sighs> my friends drove me, and it was like an hour back, and I just didn't want to. Anyways, I just wanted some place to chill. <laughs> you get no girls, bro. You're such a loser. You will never find no love, ever. Hey. All alone? Don't mind if I sit next to you. <laughs> Hi, Carly. <laughs> Did... You know, you have the most beautiful eyes in the world. Why don't we ever hang out? Do you know how beautiful you are? I've always liked you. Me too. Always had feelings for you. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm nervous. <laughs> Dude, you won't believe what Steven's doing right now. Hey, party's over! Everybody get out of here! Who, whose house is this? Oh, I, I think the owner's upstairs. The whole school found out about it. It was the most embarrassing moment. Of what a clown, man. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Shit. Oh, man. Bro. I can't believe she slept with that retarded girl from my old school. But I didn't do anything wrong. 
She was autistic. She consented. She can't even think for herself. She has a disability in her brain. Somebody like that doesn't know what they're talking about. Hey! Don't talk about her like that. I didn't do anything wrong. We had a great conversation that night. This is a serious situation, Steven. Right now, the evidence points at you taking advantage of her. We'll have to address the legal implications of your actions and you'll be facing charges. But we'll make sure the circumstances are considered. We'll work on a statement together that explains your social anxiety and the situation leading up to this. It won't absolve you, but it might influence the legal outcome. I'll have to say I'm pretty impressed, Steven. We could be a great fit for the company. Really? Yeah, your resume's solid. I don't see any reason we couldn't hire you. Great, when can I start? Um, you know what? We did hire a barista not long ago. Um, I don't think it's gonna work out. What? I thought you just said you could hire me. I know, I'm sorry, my mistake. I don't understand, did I say something? It's not gonna happen, Steven. I, I just saw your record. Oh, wait, wait, I can explain that. I was framed, I, I didn't do anything wrong. It doesn't matter, you have a criminal record. We can't have someone like you representing our company. I, I'm sorry. I understand. Steven applied for job after job, getting denied by every single employer. No one wanted to hire him because of his new criminal record. Everyone thinks that Stephen took advantage of a special needs girl, and no one believes Stephen's side of the story. The whole city hates him. And I ate a cupcake this morning. Did you hear that Stephen got out? He did? Yeah, he did. I wonder how he's doing. Why do you care? He's an animal. Disgusting for what he did. He took advantage of you and everything. No, 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 he didn't. He's my friend. It's okay, sweetie. You don't get it. I hope he gets back in jail and rots. I feel bad. I thought we had the real connection. Oh my God, he finally texted me. Do you mind if I don't meet you? I have to go. It's okay. I called my mom to pick me up. Okay, thank you. Bye. Bye, Jenna. Hi there. Hi. What's your name? Mm, I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. I'm no stranger. My name's Theo. I'm a cool guy. No need to be afraid. Mm. My name's Carly. Quiet! <laughs> quiet, quiet, quiet. Come here, come here, come here. Get down. Okay. I got some place for you. Come here. Get up. Get up. Good. You're awake. What's going on? 
Welcome to my dungeon. <laughs> You're scaring me. Let me go. No can do. Someone help me. No one can hear you scream. Help me. You'll make an excellent addition to my autistic severed head collection. <laughs> Do anything wrong. Oh, what was that? I don't know. Man. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. He got me good though. He didn't hurt you, did he? No. I love you. I love you too. I believe you, Steven. You really do care about Carly. You didn't ever take advantage of her, huh? No. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to go through what you went through. It takes a good man to do what you just did right now. I still want to be seen as a villain. And I know who I am and I just- He's my hero! And my nice and shimmering armor. Ugh. What's wrong? Ugh. Ah, stomach! Ah, 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 ah. Oh, you got me good, Steven. Ah. It's okay, Steven. I've learned so much from you. You showed me what love is about. You're an inspiration for a generation. I love... Ah. As Kari and Steven emerge from the eerie dungeon, they stumble upon a strange door. Little do they know their adventure is far from over. They cautiously explore their surroundings and stumble upon a time machine. Carly not knowing better presses the button. The Queen is here! Subscribe for part two. Hey guys, we hope you enjoyed the video and learned a valuable lesson. We just dropped a brand new Star Wars Times Tomorrow's Teachings video on our Patreon linked below where you can find exclusive content that you can't find on YouTube. If you haven't already, make sure to like, comment, and share this video with your friends and family. Don't forget to check out our new merch. Your support means the world to us. Also, don't forget to check out the Tomorrow's Teachings movie posters on our website. Only available for limited time.